Welcome to Let's Play Grand Turismo 6, Part 8. And in this segment, I kind of started my cars in the wrong place. Anyways, we're going to go to the dealership, but instead of going to the dealerships, we're going to go to the recommended cars. Which is interesting. I can't speak. So, we have pretty much groups of cars that the game is like, these would be good for this class of car racing, so yeah, there's that. But uh, I'm going to go over to the National B section here, and uh, we're going to buy this Pontiac Firebird Trans Am. Which is available in a lot of colors, but we're going to get the special edition black, because it looks fucking badass. So, we're going to buy this. For 30,000 credits, and we're going to use this for our next series. And it may or may not be uh, difficult, who knows. Will I ever use the Tomahawk X? No! Shut your hole. All we need is kit, yeah. Alright, so, got our car, let's do the race. The City Trials. Three races around city courses. With returning Madrid and Tokyo, and also London, which we've already seen in this game, so. Here we go, 550 PP uh, maximum here. And sport hard tires. But there's our typical opponents list. And before this car is OP. <laughs> I, I don't even know. The Burb! Enjoying GT6? Well, yeah. I mean, I've enjoyed this game a lot. When I first played through it, and now I'm playing through it again, and it feels just this great. And it feels even better because I'm not just using the fucking 15th anniversary cars. I'm like, yeah. Do I have pink paint with... I didn't know I got pink paint with 15th anniversary content. I don't know. I never checked my paints. Oh, yeah. So we're gonna check some things. I need to check uh, TCS and ABS off of this car. All right, let's go race at Madrid. All right, attempt two, because I wrecked the car and um, ended up barely losing, but that's okay. That's okay. Let's just not um fuck it up this time. Fuck up that one turn. Which turn was that? Oh yeah, it was the, uh... Turn after the fucking long straightaway after this hairpin, that's right. Oh, you fucker! Instead, I get spun in the first hairpin by Blackwell, you motherfucker. Alright. Well. I already answered that, I guess. Yes, I'm enjoying GT6. Okay, let's be a little uh, more mindful of how much I have to slow down here. I was very late on the brakes the last time and locked them up because I panicked, so that, that's what caused the issues. So, yeah. <laughs> Get New Year's in. Oh, no. Oh, that's third gear, not first. Also, I actually haven't used first gear in a car. What's this? Well then, apparently these guys accelerate, have a better acceleration than me. This Trans Am may look fucking awesome, but not so good in the power department. It seems, at least compared to these guys. Oh shit, back starting to hurt. That's not good. I'm getting old, man. Whoa! Big slide there. Alright. Fourth place after lap one this time, and about half the uh, time closer to Harvey. About break Spinelli here. Very good. Nice and smooth. Is probably going to accelerate me here. Oh, well, maybe not. It's a drag race. Drag race, go! Oh, and there we go. Martinez blinked at the fucking kink. All right. Um, I've heard bad things about Sebastian Lowbrow Evo. I played the demo and it was all right, but I don't know. 
then again, you gotta take my opinions with a grain of salt, because I'm more accepting, I guess. Or open-minded. Well, not, I don't know, shut me. I'm more accepting of flaws. Yeah, smoke you in the bandit car. Hey, give them out. Now, let's get around this damn NSX. Like I failed to do last time. Ooh, a little late on the brakes. Impromptu dive. Somehow worked out in my favor. Alright, well that was interesting. If I'm accepting what about Big Rigs, no. Big Rigs isn't even a game. It's a fucking meme. Oops. GG Harvey slamming into the wall like a dumbass. Okay, gonna have to lay a block here. Alright, there we go. Yeah, these things uh, accelerate a lot quicker than me. Oh well. I got the fucking Trans Am, bro. Oh, this car's older than I thought. For some reason, I thought this was like this was like a late 80s car. No, it's a 78. Also, damn, this Skyline was way the fuck behind everyone else. There he finally finishes, 18 seconds behind. Jeez. That took him forever. Forever fifth. fifth. Alright, got some of my money back. Hooray. It's all on the wrist. I wonder what that trophy is for. I don't know. Don't really care to find out. So. Two. Next race. We're going to Tokyo Route 2. For, ooh, this one's going to be a struggle with this car. Because this is a very high speed track. And I, this isn't a very high speed car. Compared to the competition. But I believe in the Trans Am. Can totally do this. I just have to uh, block like a motherfucker. Hopefully I can block. <coughs> <coughs> Voice crack. Hopefully I can block. Ooh, that's a lot of four-wheel drive cars. Two in pretzels and an Evo three. This is going to be an interesting race. Well, we'll see how this goes. Hopefully it takes more or less than two tries. Ah. Okay, this one's pretty difficult because of the lack of power on this thing. And my inability to block efficiently. So, yeah, about that. So attempt three at this race. This game may be easy, but I'm making it hard on myself. Not trying to, but it, it's kind of happening right now. Just kind of unintentionally getting very underpowered cars. Ooh, this is a bad line. All right, we're good. Managed to keep some speed. Oh, I play the Hooters racing game. What? There's a Hooters Pro Cup game? If so, maybe. It's probably not all that great of a game, but hey. Not because Hooters, but because probably like, you know, very uh, low budget dev game, considering it's not known. <laughs> the glorious sound of under understeer, I know, right? Oh, please get around with Tobby, alright. Yeah, I can do upgrades on the setup screen, like in GT5. I was choosing not to. Because, yeah. Hardcore, bro. Excuse me. Saw the Hooters game on a list of 100 worst games of all time. Yeah, it's probably just a shovelware racing game. Be interesting to try out though in like an emulator or something. Damn, these Subarus got a lot of power compared to my car. Fucking Watabi's swerving all over the place. Not sure what's up with that. Okay. 
got a car for s Thursday. It's so fancy. Mm. Oh, Booth going for the lead. And not getting the pass this time. Last time he actually did get the pass on Han. Hop over the curb. Subaru! Impossible brew! Okay, gonna stay in third gear. Dive underneath booth! Nice move. This one is actually extremely fancy. Is it a Bentley? And underneath Han, much earlier than I've been passing him. Been passing him in the section after this back straight. And this is the premium car. I'm on to something. Uh oh. I was right. Maybe. Kind of. I don't fucking know. I, I could have sworn auto. Or auto. Yeah. Moto Erotica got a Bentley. Pretty sure. Hey, Garber. More troubles with Kawa Duty? Is that why you hate your life? I'm an asshole. Alright, what kind of advantage am I going to have on Han and Booth here? Not terribly big. In the slipstream, don't have to block yet. It's fucking swerving all over the place. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. And I win. Okay. Got it. <laughs> Less, just barely under a tenth. Okay, well, that was a difficult race because my car is very underpowered. <laughs> Three of a kind. I'm getting these trophies out of nowhere. I don't know what they mean. Oh well, doesn't matter. Does matter. So there's race two done, finally. It took three tries. So let's move on to the final race. Uh since you get spun easier in this game, can you spin others out easier? I don't know. I don't know. I don't really care to try, because, you know, that ain't me. So, yeah. Anyways, we're going to Rome for our final race. Of the city trials. <laughs> Out of nowhere. Have you ever? No, I've never. So let's see. Ooh, we got an Evo 9 starting up front. That's going to be interesting. Oh, hey, Buick GNX. I got, I'm not the only one with uh, Merc and Muscle on the grid this time. Fuck yeah, GNX. Alright. Let's get started at London. Well, I guess we're on to uh, attempt number three here. Because, um... Not sure what happened there. Actually, I know what happened there. Rammed into the back of Caballero. And, uh... Made my car oversteer into the wall. Nosed into the wall. So, yeah, there was no salvaging that. So, let's just try this again. Just couldn't quite get on the inside or whatever fucking lane I was going for. I don't even remember. That was like 10 seconds ago. A little bit of oversteer there. Nothing. Too big. I'm not gonna get the dive on Bradford this time into that turn. So let's dive in this turn. <laughs> like a dumbass. Alright, see if I can get a run on Lucas here off the turn while also having room to pass him. The road gets very narrow there. Alright, five and a half behind Koivu. 
into the first turn. Easy on the throttle. All right. 3.16 in the morning. Damn, Jason. Staying up late, bro. I don't like catching cars here because there's so little room to work with. I don't know how I made that work. I really don't. But I made it work, so... Works for me. I have no idea how I made that move work, but yeah. I don't know how many more times I'm going to repeat myself here. Hello, Koivu. How you doing? I'm just going to dive up the inside here. Spin the tires a little bit. Have a little drag race with you into the final turn. There we go. Got the position. Oh, get up early because of work, I see. So you're up early instead of up late. I see. Alright, well that took uh, three tries, but hey, I won by 10 seconds. Don't mind me being stupid. Alright, anyways. Skip the replay. Damn, that car looks awesome. So, back up to 76,000 credits. Got all nine stars for the series. Huzzar! So yeah. So there we go. City trials complete, and we've unlocked one make races now. Which, once again, we'll get into when that time comes, but that time is not now. You can't see me. Anyways, that'll do it for this segment, so with that, stay tuned for more Gran Turismo 6, more National B Races.